What is up guys, Chu here, bringing you another video on Full Metal Panic. I am so excited for the new promotional video that they got, gave us. Because guys, it looks like there's going to be a lot of focus on Konami and Sosuke's relationship. Mao and Kurtz is also in it. This mysterious guy with the glasses, Leonard, you know, we're going to get more of all of this. And I'm excited because from the first one, the first video that we got, there was a kind of like a vague overview of what we could expect the animation i like it i mean it's a different studio maybe criticism is going to be there but that's all right i think that it needs to be maybe a change in there and that's all right it's fine but you know it's one of the things i want to like to mention that i saw a lot of you know, kind of comments in the my previous videos which i gotta say thank you for thank you guys for watching those videos and for those some, same people that watch those videos please watch this one as well uh criticizing isn't gonna help let's just enjoy the series i mean i love it we all love it so let's just enjoy and then if there's some complaints we'll definitely address those i guess after the episodes and when the season is done because guys i will definitely be reviewing this so if you guys haven't subscribed to me, please do so. I will be reviewing this. And there is no re official release date yet of when it's coming, but it is coming next year. And it's just getting stronger and stronger with what we're getting. I mean, like I said, they were going to redo you know, the season, the first season, and then have you know a three-part trilogy movies. So I'm, like, I'm just excited. Also, I really want to know why Tessa in this promotional video is with Leonard. I mean, it looks to me as if they're mourning their parents. That, to me, seems obvious, or at least other loved ones that cared for them. This guy with the, with the glasses is either his partner, an enemy, I don't know who he is. The re maybe he might be the reason why Leonard is doing what he's doing. But, I'm just excited. And I did mention uh, Kurt Weber. If not, I'm going to mention it now. Speaking of him, I mentioned... Uh, excuse me. I met Vic Manana this weekend, and if you guys don't know, he is the English version, English dub uh, voiceover, sorry, for Kurt Weber. And I asked him what he thought about, personally, the season one, you know, rehash. And he said he's looking forward to it. You know, he he, he had heard about it. Hopefully, he actually gets to work on it. I, I would be great for him to have his character return. Chris Patton to return as well. I want to see Lucy Christian come back. I watched both dub and sub, but I love the dub version for some reason. And I don't really say that about dubs very often. Maybe because it's that childhood thing for me. Growing up, I watched it. I don't know. But I'm just really excited, guys. Uh, and speaking of it, I have a vlog on my second channel, and I will leave a link to that, as well as a link of this. So please do check out my second channel and go sub to that. I promise you, you won't regret watching him. He is hilarious. And the link for this, for the, for, the, uh, for the actual trailer, if you guys want to go check it out. So guys, thank you very much. Um, I'm just excited as you guys are. And as always, stay safe, and I will catch you later.